Hello, ladies and gents, I am Mr. SNS, and welcome to Terraria. This is my character. And, uh, this is a fun game. I wanted to, to be honest, I wanted to play Minecraft, but, uh, I couldn't re- I couldn't install it on my new computer for whatever reason, and I'm still trying to figure that out. But, this is a fun game, too. I've been playing it, um, well, I guess not super lately, but I have been playing it a little, uh, a little bit. Uh, need to stop using filler words, um, dang it, I did it again. Why guy, Wyatt, uh, my cousin, said, uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm trying not to use filler words, I'm sorry. But Y guy told me that. Oh, by the way, he's on a camp out currently for scouts, and he wanted me while he was gone to make a video. And I just went, okay, I'll do Terraria because I'm a good friend, and I don't know. Sorry, I wasn't doing much there. I've been learning that with YouTube, the best thing to do is keep people's attention. And that's why I think it's a good idea to not just sit here. Because I don't want to make this boring for any of you guys. I recently hit 10 subscribers, yay! Just like uh, a lot of the other ones. I, just like a lot of, a lot of you guys, I actually know you in real life. I know you also in real life. You know who you are. I'm not going to say your name because I don't know if you'd be okay with that on YouTube. But yeah, thank you. I, I guess I could call this a 10 subscriber special, but really I'm, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm not making this a career or anything, this is just for fun, you know, but uh, if, if I did want to do anything special, it would be like the one year anniversary of my YouTube channel, which I missed, I'm sorry. My birthday is actually the one year anniversary of this channel, I, well, not my... What am I saying? I, I shouldn't have to spell things out. What I was going to say is it's not my literal birthday, obviously. But... I do like birth date, but... You know, my birthday is February 3rd. And... Yeah, Wyatt sat me down on my 13th birthday. I'm 14 now, but he sat me down on my 13th birthday. Because that's... I guess the legal age for a YouTube channel, and and yeah, he just went, all right, you're making a YouTube channel, and sure enough, I have a YouTube channel now. It's a very bad one, and I, I could recommend some other YouTube channels that are really good, but if you haven't clicked away, then you're probably here to watch me. Yay! The... Uh, the, the other thing I would have celebrated, I guess, is the another anniversary. I was thinking, oh, I could do a special for my one-year anniversary of my first YouTube video. You know that weird channel trailer, the one where I'm wearing the mask thing? And I do those weird things with my hands? Yeah, that's my first YouTube video, and I, that was uploaded July 6th, yeah, Ju I believe it was July 6th, and now it's the 13th, by the way, happy Friday the 13th, everybody, this is a great holiday to celebrate misfortune and bad luck. Unless you're superstitious, and I don't know what superstitious people do. I'm not superstitious, though. 
the which is why after I'm done with this video, I'm just going to go outside and set up a whole aisle, uh, a whole hallway of ladders and just walk under all of them. And I'm going to try to rig a system where I just walk under a bunch of ladders and and have a bunch of black cats walk in front of me. I, my neighbor has a bunch of cats. I don't know if any of them are black. There's an orange one and another orange one. But I could probably paint them black or something. They're always, they always find their way into, our, into my yard. But who knows? I'm... If you're superstitious, don't worry, I'm not making fun of you. I'm just not superstitious myself, and... Yeah. I need to learn what's also bad luck. Is spilling salt bad luck, or is that good luck? Oh yeah, this is, uh, this is Scott. He's a... Guide guy. He'll help, or something. I don't know. Alright, here's what I'm doing right now. I'm setting up a nice little dirt thing and I'm putting this wood thing on top and this will be my home. Wait, what am I doing? I I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm sorry. I I don't know. I'm not good at this game, by the way. Just like most games, I'm not good at them. I guess I'm good at Roblox, but I don't know if that's really a compliment or not, unless you're a Roblox fan or something, and then it might be an honor. But, uh... But, yeah, I'm not good at this game. It's becoming nighttime. There's a day and night cycle, like most survival-type games. And I... Oh yeah, and warning, spoiler alert for this series. Uh, I am going to die a lot. I'm going to die a lot. I am really, really, really bad at this game. Um... The only experience I have is a couple of worlds, which I've played on uh, before, and then, and then a couple of worlds which I have shared with a couple of my friends, and, ah, excuse me, I can't talk right now, uh, I share, anyways, I, I've shared a couple of worlds with a bunch of, with some friends of mine. They were pretty generous. They were the ones that got me into Terraria in the first place. Well, I've never really been into Terraria. I've never been a huge fan of it, but they're the reason I have Terraria, and they're actually the reason I have a Steam account, so if you guys are watching... I don't know if you're subscribed or not. I know one of you two has seen my channel, but... Uh, yeah, thank you for convincing me to get a Steam account. Actually, I might have had the Steam account before that. I don't remember. It was... I don't remember what my first game was. It was either this or FNAF World. Yes, I did play that. And yes, I actually enjoyed it. Um, I don't know if I'll play. I don't know if I'll play it or not. I keep bringing up Five Nights at Freddy's. I don't need to bring it up though. What am I doing here? I need to leave this close. It's nighttime. I'm going to die if I don't just prepare right now. All right, Scott. Just you and me. Let's go. Now, there might be a little bit of time left. I don't know how safe it is out there. 
Actually, I need to make some torches and other stuff. Is that butterfly made of gold? No. I don't know what that was. Alright. You'll need- I'll need a lot of torches. I don't think this is very safe. But I'm a boy scout. And my scout troop only, my scout troop only taught a little bit of fire safety. That's a joke, by the way. We learned a lot of fire safety. We learned all the things. Uh, but this isn't very safe in real life. Don't light a fire in your house, kids. But this is Terraria. This is fiction. It's a video game. I can do what I want, and I want to have a campfire in the house. First off, look at this light. And then second, you see this thing, the cozy fire? Your life regen is slightly increased. You can regenerate health. And that is a really good thing. For obvious reasons. Alright, this slime here. I kind of want to go out and kill it, but now the nighttime music is playing, and it's officially nighttime. And I don't- if, if the slime comes down here, then I'll just open the door and kill it, but... If not, then... I'm staying in here, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not leaving. Scott! I was about to open the door and run out, but then I was going, oh no, I'll be a liar then. Fine! Be that way, Scott! Wow, what's, what are the odds of that? I have... This character is Scott. Maybe I'll pretend he's my uncle. I have an uncle named Scott. Today's his birthday. Hi, Scott. Happy birthday and happy Friday the 13th. Just avoid all black cats and ladders in the area. Get a rabbit's foot and maybe a horseshoe. That, that could help. These are demon eyes here. I forgot to mention that. That's a green slime, and that's this flying guy is a demon eye. I treat you guys like you don't know anything, but I'm, I'm, but really, I, I don't know. Are you okay with that, or really? Because I just assume that nobody has played this game. I don't know. This isn't a new game by any means. This, Oh no. Ah, there's a little hole there. But th this is not a new game. Uh, mm. I think that's actually... Wyatt and I have both said it that... I can't speak. Wyatt and I have both said that one of the flaws with our channel is we don't have the latest games. I might have said this in my identity fraud video. But we do not have the latest games. We don't have the money for all the latest games. Not all the latest games look very fun. You know, we're just... Therefore, we're playing what we want to play. And there's nothing wrong with that, but, you know, people don't really always want to watch old games. I don't want to go out to help you, man. <sighs> oh, there's not too much. It's the problem with this... I think I've got a copper sword. Or is it... Yeah, it's copper, right? Or... I think it's copper. Yeah, it's a copper short sword. Look at this. Look at this. Clicking is all you can really do to make anything be used, I guess. You don't have to aim your sword. You just click and it does a thing. 
but the copper sword just goes left or right, and that's all it can do. Eventually, I'll start getting better swords. That's a zombie. I'll start getting better swords, and it's breaking down the door. I'll start being able to get better swords, and I'll be able to swing overhead, and there'll be knockback and all this good stuff. Are those his teeth or what? Or are those his fingers? I don't know. Yay! I said I will be dying a lot, but in in my la the last time I played this game, I died at least 50 billion times the first night. It was like I said, I'm not good at this game. I'm not good at most games. But... I'm hearing the, the zombie still, and I don't know if I should be concerned. Of course I should be concerned. Where are they? Well, I take it back again. I'm not- I don't think I really need to be concerned. As long- oh, there they are. Right there. As long as they're not coming over to kill me. I might need to build a bridge there. Oh, here's something I've never thought of. I should build... Can you get... Yeah, you can get steel doors, I think. I want to be able to get doors that can't break. I don't know if any of those exist. Or they all exist. But... I'd like to be able to do that and build a big wall. Oh. Uh, my brother is back from summer school, and I'll need to go open the door. I'll be right back. Sorry. I'm sorry about that. I'm back, though. Just had to open the door for Devin. Uh, yeah, here we are. Uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? That's actually a really dumb idea. I'm not doing hardcore mode or anything right now. There is an unlockable hardcore mode. You have to defeat a boss called the Wall of Flesh. And it'll open you to hardcore mode, but there's another hardcore mode where you can't respawn. I'm not playing that, and I'm actually playing softcore mode, which is the easier. But really, I could not, I would not be able to handle hardcore mode where I can't respawn. I, I'm fortunate that I've survived this long, I'm serious. Oh yeah, and I mentioned the Wall of Flesh. I forgot to mention that also unlike Minecraft, well Minecraft has I think three bosses now, but also unlike Minecraft, besides being side-scroller and other stuff like that, this game has a ton of bosses. There are regular mode bosses, there's hardcore mode bosses, which we will see later on. There is... Uh, there are event bosses. When I talked about, I talked about sharing a game with 
a couple of my friends. We killed a couple of those. I think we killed either the Easter one or the Halloween one. I can't remember. I don't... I wasn't there to kill it. <laughs> I, I... I gotta... No! No! This was a horrible mistake. This was a horrible mistake. What have I done? I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die in a very pathetic way. <laughs> because I wanted to get a shooting star. And it did not go well. It's daytime. Most likely the zombies will ignore me. Good. Okay. I'm going to build a bridge now. I need to build a bridge here. Uh. But... Anyways, what was I talking about? I don't remember. Oh yeah, it was an event boss. And... I was not there to kill it because I it, it, it murdered me really fast. You know, we... They spawned the boss. I saw it. It was there. And then everything went black. And it was, they had spawned it really far away from the house. I, I don't, I don't remember entirely all the details of the world, but I don't think they had a battle platform beside their house. Uh, so we went really far away from the house and I wasn't able to get back because I'm not good at the game and I came into the game later than everyone else and all the what all the supplies I had was stuff they gave to me and therefore I didn't have a horse or anything like they did where I could just run back and go help them I didn't have a way to teleport you know I, I was unprepared in every way but yeah <laughs> there was an event boss in, let's see, I've never fought a boss by myself. I've never fought a boss by myself on the version I'm currently playing on the computer. But I have fought several, no, I fought one boss in the main no, no, I don't know what I'm talking about. I can't speak today. I'm sorry. I have fought one boss in the mobile version on an iPad. I, f I think it's the second boss, if I'm not mistaken. The, uh, the Eye of Cthulhu. Not a very hard boss, but he's pretty cool. Uh... He will either... I said he's the second boss, but he will either be the first or the second that I fight. Because before that, there's one, I believe it's called the Slime King. And the Slime King... It, it can spawn naturally, but the... The way to spawn it, I think, is kind of difficult. I don't remember the exact thing you have to do. I'll do a lot of the research off off screen, off or off camera. But my wood. But I'll try to, if I can, I'll try to fight him first. Because I don't, I don't think I have OCD or anything, but I am kind of a completionist in a way. I always need to have everything. I need to finish 100% and I need to do everything in the proper order. And that's just, that's just how, who I am as a person. That's, that's how I behave. I need to do things in a very specific order. 
and on I think the official Terraria website it lists the Slime King as the first boss. Therefore, I'm going to treat him as the first boss, and I'm going to try to kill him first unless I have Cthulhu spawns naturally. I don't think Cthulhu is in this. There is a boss. I think it's the final boss. He looks a lot like Cthulhu, but he's. I don't think he. And I think he might be meant to be Cthulhu, but he's not Cthulhu. And that's kind of sad. I wish he was. That would be really awesome, actually. Fight Cthulhu, you know? I, 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 I've gotten a little bit into... I don't know if this is symmetrical. I'm going to end up going over this. But I've gotten a little bit into HP Lovecraft. And I've read two stories from the Cthulhu mythos. The most well-known, of course, is Call of Cthulhu, which I haven't read. And... I'm sorry, I'm distracted here. Uh, but I have read this one called Dagon, or Dagon, and the and Nearlethotep. And they're part of the Cthulhu mythos, and it's actually really interesting. I should read Call of Cthulhu, but yeah. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seven, sixteen, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, 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 no. That's. That's just sick and raw. We're not doing that. 17, 17. Okay. Then I need to replace these torches. But, yeah. And, uh, yeah, I like H.P. Lovecraft's stories. The just the two that I read were pretty good. I wish they were full novels. The, From what I've seen, they're just kind of simple short stories. But they're interesting. They're interesting. And then the concept of a bunch of otherworldly monsters intrigues me. That Cthulhu is an interesting entity character, and the fact that Terraria kind of uses the concept of Cthulhu or something similar is really cool. Uh, this video has gone on for a little bit. I'm going to craft some new tools. Wooden sword. Oh, well I got a wooden sword. And a wooden bow. I've got wooden armor. And I'm ready to take on the next thing. I don't know. Well, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed. I'm going to try to stop asking to... I'm going to try to stop asking you to subscribe and comment. You could do that if you want. Uh, but that's actually the reason why I'm going to uh, stop asking. Because if you like it, if you enjoy this, you'll like it on your own. You guys can think for yourselves. You subscribe if you if you really enjoy and if you really want to. But anyways, with that, I hope you all enjoyed and I hope you are looking forward to this series and I hope you continue watching. That w this would be really fun to do. Uh, it if there's any, well, I don't know I, about asking for requests for games because I don't really, like I said, I don't have money to buy games, but yeah, I'm going to try to get a good variety of games if I can, and I, I'll just redo the intro. 
thanks for watching. Good day.